Okay. So um, on on our uh, knee oral practical, um, we're going to have this is uh, anterior zone one. And so what we're looking at first is we're going to look at the quadricep muscles. So I'm going to have my athlete in this uh, position here, but with the uh, knee at 90 degrees. I'm going to have him kind of push into my hand so I can get his quads to flex. And so what we're going to try to outline, here, grab the cap off that, would you please there? So what we're going to try to outline is we've got the vastus medialis muscle. So it's kind of this kind of round muscle here, vastus medialis. That's the VM. Okay. And then in the center here is the rectus femoris, the RF, rectus femoris. And then on the outside, laterally then, is going to be your vastus lateralis, the VL. You don't see the vastus intermedius because it's below the rectus femoris, okay? So then the next thing you looked at then is saying, he said, um, we want you guys to be able to palpate the quad tendon. So we find that quadriceps tendon right up here in this area here. And so it's where your quadricep muscles come down and the common tendon attaches to then your patella, okay? So now relax your leg for a second, relax. And so you can push in this area and you might actually feel, you know, some tissue, but it's easy if you're in that area and you keep your, like, your finger like this or even your thumb and then you have them go ahead and kick into your hand down here with a little bit of resistance you'll feel that get nice and hard well that's that tendon right there that quadriceps tendon okay so some people you know strain the quadriceps tendon sometimes they can rupture it um, so it's just an area that we want to be able to palpate then going from there we have then the patella we've kind of outlined it there right and then the areas that we focus on are what we refer to as the superior pole or edge up here, and then the inferior pole, the lower edge down there. And the reason for that is we say that their quad tendon here attaches to the superior pole of your patella. And then if we go down here, lower now, so patella, now we're at the inferior pole of the patella. This is what we've done is mark this out. This is your patellar tendon. And that then attaches to, the, again, the inferior pole of the patella. So we should be able to palpate that. Okay, and then then we go down here. I made this little kind of little you know U looking shape here. This is the um, tibial tuberosity or tubercle. That's where your patellar tendon attaches onto the tibia. So when we start looking at areas that um, that might be common for some injuries, we have here at the um, tibial tuberosity or tubercle. That's where Oshkud slaughters occurs. And, send, and then the funky one, um, Sinden, Sending Larson Johansson is here at the inferior pole, okay? And then, of course, if we're here on the tendon itself, we could either be, you know, patellar tendonitis or the tendinosis. And then same thing up here on your quadriceps tendon. So I believe that was all of our, yep, that was all of our stuff on that uh, anterior zone one. So hopefully that helped with the drawing a little bit. We'll talk about some of these other things in another video.